Do not uh, put in the adjusting my wig and pulling it forward on this channel or one of y'all are gonna die. Now y'all know, I'm gonna put these sunglasses away and if this wig fall off, no ma'am. Well, happy Sunday, everyone. Actually, when you're watching this, it's probably not Sunday, but it's Sunday for us. If I sound funny, I have gum and I have my Invisalign in, so. So, we went to church this morning, and now, just as a casual afternoon, we're gonna head over to Animal Kingdom. Get a face paint, go on rides, go on games. That's right, so we're gonna have a fun kind of mommy daughters. We'll Plural date. And we each have a Disney item. Like mommy has her sunglasses, I have my bed, and, and I have a mini umbrella. Umbrella. Do you see why I, I don't like normally vlog really with them? Um, just so you know, yes, these are Minnie Mouse boutique looking uh, sunglasses. They're by Karen Walker. They are sold out. I had to buy these bad boys from Australia. Yeah, that they are completely sold out. They come in black and they come in pink. I will love these forever. I'll never give them up. So I, if I can find something similar, I will link it below. I am trying to put together a store just so all my Disney items that you guys see or may want or people ask me about, you can just always go there and check out the stuff that I've worn or I am wearing. Today's bag is this Disney princess bag. And as you can see, it's pink and it has the little crowns all over it. And it has the Disney, um, the Cinderella's castle on the front. And this charm right here that has the little magical D for Disney and it is by Loungefly. Now again, this is not a current product, but if I can find it online, I will link it below. Look, I still have tags on that. I didn't even take, take them off. So this is the unicorn from the movie Inside Out. It has um, um this It has rainbow hardware, yeah. which is really pretty. And the inside- A blue strap is rainbow. Perfect, I got one. So Why we will definitely link it? that one below as well if you wanna check out that Disney product. I have my Disney Bulova, I don't even know how to pronounce this brand, Bulova. It's a men's watch, but I like men's watches because I like big face watches. So it's gold and it's silver, which is nice, and the face can look gold or silver depending on how it goes. Uh, and it has Cinderella's castle on there and little it's diamonds. It's so pretty. And last but not least is my glitter Mickey case. I, everywhere I go, people ask me about this case. Everywhere. This is not an official Disney merch. It's not actually Disney. Oh, it just has little. It just has little mouse ears on it, but it's not Disney. Um, but I definitely will link where I get this from, and it comes in different colors, and it's cheap, and it's really nice and does the job. No, no, do not uh, put in me adjusting my wig and pulling it forward on this channel or one of y'all are gonna die. Fun fact, it seems like every Disney park right now is getting their entrance redone. We rode that tram for like 15 seconds <laughs> and we're not at the entrance. You actually have to keep walking to get to the entrance when you get dropped off. So we should have just walked. So keep be aware that if you ride the tram, you literally will probably still be walking and you won't be dropped off at the very front of the park. We have arrived. The Animal Kingdom. Have we have a fast pass for Expedition Everest. Yeah. There she is. So we are entering Dino Land USA, and they have some of my favorite things, and also the worst ride for me in all of Disney World. What is it? The Dino Spin, the Dino something. Anyway, it's down because it needs work. It needs to be deleted. I need them to remove it from the parks. It's the worst ride. It gets literally every time I ride it, I feel like I've like it's like a carnival ride. It's like my it's like organs are bursting and being bruised on it. It is just horrible. Everything else here is amazing. That's the worst ride Disney's ever put in a park ever, hands down. And most people would agree. No, yeah, everyone hates it. My nemesis, my kryptonite, primeval world. If you want me to have a bad day at a Disney park, put me on that thing. Do girls know which ones you want? Yeah, the last time I got this one, so this one, but I'm gonna choose this one today. All right, Ellie, which one are you getting? Uh, I think I wanna get this cool one. 
to Butterfly. I was going to pick that one for you. So Naya is getting this one. Ellie is getting this one. So we're also getting some game vouchers. I decided to get the six um, vouchers. You get four bonus. So really you get ten because both of them play. So they'll each get five. Just so you know, face painting and the games are a separate charge here at Disney. So let me tell you how much you to expect to spend when you want to do these extras. So this is my plus time. Really? Right. Close your eyes for me. As you guys can see, Ellie already put makeup on herself this morning. Is it a little bit cold? Yeah. for the 10 vouchers is $30. So far, we spent $68, um, but it's a pretty fun time, but that is outside of your normal ticket, so, you know, if you bring some cash, you know. Because I think the Yeti's gonna grab it. Even though I'm like, why do you keep doing that? I just do it. So we're now at Thirsty River Bar. So we had a few minutes to kill before getting on this ride. 
Our fast pass time is at 2.15 and it's now 2.23. We got here a little too early. Scat. You know what scat is? Who? Yeah. Oh look, that's a bear skull right there. What is that? That's an ape. Uh, prehistoric giant, they don't know. Fun fact, riding in the back of a roller coaster is actually a more thr of a thrill ride than riding in the front. Although I just enjoy riding in the front, so I'm going to ask for the front. But the back is actually faster and kind of gives you more of a jolt and kind of a whip around. One and two. All right, you guys are road two. on the expedition ever. That ain't gonna work, sir. Alright, y'all. If my wig blows off, y'all already know it's gonna be, me and the Yeti are gonna be fighting. But I guess it's my fault for wearing it today. Ooh, girl, he's blowing up. Gotta hold this wig now, sis. Today, right? Yeah, we usually see the Yeti. Like, he, he wasn't really like I in my face the more. way I needed him to be. You know how he usually sounds like squat, like you, yeah. you think he's gonna grab your hair? This time I closed my eyes, but I was like, I don't hear the Yeti or like I don't know, it was weird. It was fun though, the ride was good, so well, fly, fly it was a good time. Fun. I can't get a new bed now. I want a bed that's like full, kind of like mommy's bed, 
but I want it to be white with pink pillows or white pillows and like a garden under it. I want my food to be like a whole garden and like maybe flowers everywhere. everywhere. Here is all the construction stuff. Bubbles, come to me. And Ellie's playing with the bubbles. Mommy, the can I tell you what I'm gonna do anything I don't like Ellie? So when I'm gonna do it because I can't get a phone now. I'm gonna get the newest, I don't know, like iPhone 30 or something. Now you have to talk about an iPhone nonstop and I'm about to die. You must get me one or I will possess you. Have no one you. To call. I have so no, many people. You're so people. close to me. Can you please? I have so many away? people I can call. This is how I'm gonna clean you guys off. Ew! Every Give me a giant lick. Come here, Ellie. Let me lick you. No, get your dirty stuff Oh, I'm dirty. You came for me, so does that make you? All right, that's it. I came and conquered. I gotta fix my little self up. Moral of the story today is when you take your daughters on a date to Disney and you get on a roller coaster, you need to secure your wig. Moral of the story. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at Mommy Cray Cray and subscribe to this channel for more fun. I do DIY stuff and I also vlog our life here living at Disney World. All right, see you guys later. Bye.